You have one of our brothers that was doing his job and even trying to assist a sister, trying to assist her with the heat, but she came out there with a bad attitude. Let's review it. Excuse me. Like, what? Oh, my bad. I oh, Mr. Joe told me to come fix your AC. I don't give a f what nobody told you. Why is you back here? I mean, I'm just trying to help you out. Now I'm, I'm doing my job. I was told your AC out. You hot. I'm trying to fix your AC. That ain't got nothing to do with you. You're not supposed to be in my backyard. You're not supposed to be in my backyard. Bruh. Ain't this 2936? You know where you came at. All right, then. Well, I'm trying to do my job. Be cool. Chill out. Let me... I'm not going to be cool. I got churn in here. Like, you cannot be in somebody's backyard without their permission. That's what I'm saying. You can't be back here. You're doing way too much. All right, brother. Chill out. Let me do my job. You got kids, y'all. Huh? Let me fix these AC and I'm going by my business. Well, what part of you ain't supposed to be in my backyard? Is your stupid story dumb? Like, you cannot be in nobody's backyard like that. I wouldn't care what he got going on. Are you trying to fix my AC? Shoot, especially down here in Houston. Man, it's been like 100 plus degrees almost every day down here. We may be lucky here lately to get it maybe around 97, 96. But it is hot as hell. So I'm not saying they in Houston, but man, listen, I don't want to be without my AC not one day. So if he in my backyard... I was like, yeah, man, brother, appreciate seeing you or whatever. Shoot, man, you need some water, man, or something? Make sure you 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 good? Like, sh what are you complaining about, your nasty attitude? Chill out, be cool, bro. Really? No, like, you. next time when you come to my house, this is my house, Joe, Joe do not okay, stay here. First of all, watch your tone. Let me do my job, you hear me? You fall back, I'm about to get this AC done. Chill out. You ain't about to, then you not about to play with me like that. And Joe do not stay here. He can't tell nobody to come to my house. This is my property. You cannot come back here in my yard without my permission. Man, you can't do that. You pay rent. You don't even own this. I don't give a what I do. This is my Now see if I can call somebody over here to be something. I'm trying to tell you, you just can't do that. So now you're just going to ignore me. Do what you do. If you want to call me, the Joe call him. It is what it is. Now, see, that's what I'm talking about. I'm just trying to tell you that you need to be out in my backyard. You can't come. Next time you come here, knock on the damn door. That's it. Man, look, your landlord told me to come back. I don't got to get no permission for you to come fix an AC that you don't own. You do you damn sure do you? You have to. Like, you ain't got, you not about to come in my backyard and not tell me you back here. I got this. Chill out, be cool. Man, I'm telling you right now. I'm about to call Mr. Joe because this I'm I'm not doing this. You're not about to be coming on my property and doing this. You're not. Because I'm telling you, that could have been real bad. That could have ended up real bad. Now, what if I would have acted a, another way? Say, brother, you know what? I ain't got time for this. Man, you won't be hot. Stay hot. No, I'm telling you, get your back here without telling me. Lord, I'm like, man, look, <laughs> any kind of contract to come to my house, man, look, I'm trying to make sure they good, man. I'm not tripping on anything like that. But so now your nasty attitude got you to stay in the heat. Like, like you all, like, why y'all have to always prove something? Why you always got this to be run off at the mouth? Think about the kids, man, the kids in the heat. Then the kids need the AC. Like, what, 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 what are you doing? And I, I he better than me because I left much sooner than that. I wasn't been jaw jacking her that long. I, like he said, I was like, hey man, you know, I was hired to, to do this. He, he wants me to fix it. Now, what I would have done, I would have called him on the phone and said, listen, your tenant here, she's upset. She don't want me in the backyard. You told me to come. You want to talk to her or whatever? Because if she keeps this up, I'm gone, and she can stay in the heat. Is that because I am not about to be disrespected like that by this woman. I don't know this woman. I don't know nothing about her whatsoever. I do not come to work to be disrespected by nobody. I'll come here, do my job and, and get to the next one, but don't let your attitude talk you out your blessings. That's the only thing I'm saying because if someone come and fix AC, I remember one year, um, at the previous place I used to stay at, we had like uh, two units. We had the upstairs unit, downstairs unit. I mean, one year the upstairs unit went out. My Lord, 
you know, it was, ooh, it was hot up there. We all stayed downstairs and everything until, you know, I think it may be like a day or two for them to get it fixed. But yeah, yeah, yeah. It's way too hot to be having no AC. No, 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 no. AC break, you got to go to a hotel room or something because no, no. Mm -mm, mm -mm. But especially when you have kids. Think about your dog on kids. But unfortunately, people like her, they don't think about their children because they're so, so selfish. They want to just get their stupid point across.